Hey guys, welcome to part six of the optimization series, and this is going to be looking at finding out how much all your textures and objects within your game are actually worth, and how you can adjust and scale down accordingly. And you can build out a log file, which is almost like just a text file when you build your game, and it will just tell you how much space each of the textures that you're using, all the models, all the shaders, and gives you an idea of if, say, you've got one massive texture, which is, say, 4K resolution, and you, and you don't realize why your builds are becoming so big it might point out that a specific texture is taking up a lot of space so I'll quickly go through this this is just a basic scene and it's just so we can build this out more quickly you'd be finishing your game do whatever you can go file um, build settings and I'm just gonna put the my scene here which is optimization scene here and I'm gonna build it out to Windows Mac and it doesn't really matter what settings we choose to use. I'm just going to save to my desktop and then build it out. And once it's built, then we will have a look at the file that it's produced. So it's built my game to the desktop and that's all well and good now. But we need to go to Window and Console. And you might have already had this up, but if you don't, it's just there. And from the console, well, however it pops up or if you've got it docked down the bottom, you can click on the little... Um, sort of very much in this corner a little drop down and you can open something called the editor log and you can see here we get a load of different things we get a lot of information about what's going on and what is built out and what the version of the unity is and we want to scroll on down we want to scroll on down the, um, the pretty much quite far down our um, log and we want to find out the total sort of allocation it will give you some information of how much memory things have taken up but here you can see that it'll give um, an idea of how much um, space my textures are taking up in the build how much space the meshes are animations sounds shaders uh, other assets level scripts um, and things like that and then it will give you an idea of how much these are taking on where these are located so you can see that from my textures for this um, sort of metallic photo frame you can see each of these materials that I've got are taking up 0 0.2 0 0.1 kilobytes respectively and if you've got a whole host of materials models textures anything like that you can see that how much um, memory it's going to be taking up and then you can do something accordingly so say if I've realized that the metallic smoothness of my picture holder here that maybe was a little bit large I could go into find that model and I can see the metallic smoothness and I can go well it's currently set to 2k I could probably set that down to 1 and I'd probably half the size of the load on the you know the game and the file size when it's built out so little by little you can sort of work towards you know slowly fine-tuning build size your optimization for everything that you've got the smaller the textures um, the faster everything will run the biggest thing for your build size will be your textures because especially the higher the resolution and the more detail they have in obviously if you're using a PBR sort of setup you will have um, a lot more textures usually but you know just it takes you to sit down take some time and have a look um, you know as you go through your project just to keep it manageable so you just got to remember that you want to build your game out file build and then you want to go to window console unless you've got it open and then in the corner you can go there and open up the log and every time you build out it will produce another log file for you so you can keep on um, you know managing and be on top of all your sizes so hopefully this helped you out thanks very much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe cheers